While the rubble is cleared, the memory of the storm remains. Weather is so unpredictable. My sister would not have been careless and gone outside had she known that it was severe weather. 50-year-old Angie Hanchett was outside where she had just put her truck away when a tornado struck this Kinross farm. I uh, went kind of crazy. I mean, I went I was screaming and crying. and Debris from the tornado hit Angie. She died a short time later. She was my one of my best friends. For Angie's youngest sister, Rita, and her husband, Dirk, a pastor who officiated the funeral, it's been a tough couple of weeks. And I've done quite a few funerals, um, but by far this was the most difficult one I've ever done. But with the pain comes faith that Angie's death can prevent others from falling victim to severe weather. A lot of times we wouldn't go to the basement if the sirens would go off. You know, we just kind of go outside and stand outside. And the weather can change in the blink of an eye just for people to if the alarms go up, sirens go off to take cover. They also hope Angie's death will inspire others how to live. We never know when the words that we say to somebody could be the last words we ever speak to them. You know, treat the people in our lives as being as special as they really are. Because while Rita wasn't ready for her sister to say goodbye, their last moment was a good one. She had celebrated Easter with us and we had a really good time. We laughed and we giggled. A calming memory that the storm can't take away. In Kinross, Sadie Hughes, CBS 2 News.